All right, guys, I'm going to teach you how to do deadlifts. We always teach the stiff leg or Romanian deadlifts, and basically what that means is we're trying to get the hamstrings activated. So the back of the leg is what we're trying to work. Um, you will feel some lower back to some degree, but if you're feeling it more in your lower back than you are your hamstrings, something's not going on right. So the movement looks like this. If there was something behind you about a foot, foot and a half, you're going to keep that weight at the barbell in close to you. You're going to drive the hips backwards to get down. So we're not bending at the lower back. I'm not just dropping down, picking something up. What I'm doing is I'm hinging the hips back to get that weight down. And then I'm lifting with the hamstrings. There's several different things that need to happen in the movement. One of them needs to be the shoulder blades need to be back. So a lot of times when you pick something up, the shoulder blades roll forward to get to the ground quicker. But you want to have those shoulder blades back the entire time. Also, as you are going down the leg, once you get past the knee, you got to go towards the ankles. Keep the, you're almost scraping your legs the entire way down. Something that you're going to be using on these, especially when you increase your weight, is wrist wraps. They're going to go on your hands like this. They're going to be sliding across your hands. You're going to just throw this up under here, wrap it under first, around, on top, under, around, on top. They don't have to be tight because you, what you can do is you can crank that weight into you and that tightens up your wrist wrap. Now, if we're picking it up off of the uh, off the rack, put it on your legs, get your chest up, repeat. A lot of times you're picking this up off the ground, and in that case, we're going to do a regular deadlift, which means you're going to squat down, get your eyes up, going to get adjusted at that point, and then we can set the shoulder blades back and start knocking off the stiff legged deadlifts. So again, keeping that weight in close to you, keeping the shoulder blades back, and hinging at the hips. All my weights in the heels of the shoes. And that is a stiff-legged deadlift. Again, got to get the hamstrings working, not in the lower back. If you're doing your like 12 reps, the last two you feel the lower back, that's fine. That's normal. You're going to feel some degree of lower back. Uh, if you have trouble getting your hamstrings activated, there's two things you can do. Number one, your calves are probably tight, so you're going to need to get on a foam roller, roll those out. Another thing that we can do is we can elevate the toes and force more weight in your heels. This also helps you drive the hips back. So just put a pad or something about a half inch up under your toes and that will help you get the hamstrings activated and do the deadlift right.